o'clock. They are calling themselves the New Miami, and today the University of Miami football team took part in its first spring practice under new head coach Manny Diaz. But the real news came hours after that first practice ended. The NCAA has cleared transfer quarterback Tate Martell to play this season for the Hurricanes. The QB granted a waiver after transferring from Ohio State. CBS 4's Mike Cunio has more on day one of practice from Coral Gables. I get it. I get it. Christmas comes early for Manny Diaz and the new Canes coaching staff. Spring ball is here and it brought an up-tempo, no-nonsense first day to the practice field. What we wanted to do is that we have knocked everyone out of their comfort zone, which is ideally what we wanted, you know, and there, there's not a guy on this field that's got it all figured out, um, and that's, that's part of what we think is going to make us better. The excitement level was real from players, coaches, and even alumni. What's going on, Mike? <laughs> Hurricane legends like Greg Olson and Michael Irvin were on hand, dropping some knowledge on the current Canes, an old feel for the new Miami. We got out of having fun, and then we, we try to we got away from ourselves, you know. But the standard is something Coach Diaz trying to set again that the defense held ourselves to, and we trying to make that a whole team thing. Just the pace and the overall energy, you know. Coach Diaz, when he says in New Miami, he obviously meant it. New offensive coordinator Dan Enos was easy to spot. His fiery on-field personality matched an offense that featured more shifting and motion, a change from last year's stuck in the mud attack. He needs to find a quarterback, though. Nikosi Perry and Jaron Williams took first and second team snaps, while Ohio State transfer Tate Martell, who was just cleared to play by the NCAA, is turning some heads. Extremely, extremely good athlete. He's got great lower body explosiveness, uh, really good short area quickness, and showed a very live arm today. He's a character, dude. He's a 5'11 little white dude with tattoos, running around with high energy, cocky, just loves the swag. His swag is so Miami. The Martell news could be a game changer, but this group says it didn't matter who the QB was come August because they say the hype around the program is the real deal. Well, outside this building, I think everyone feels the energy. Everyone feels the passion of what's going on. But inside this building, I think it is the, summed up by the, the Miami standard. When he says the new Miami, he's, he's being for real, y'all. The new Miami, the elite. Just tune in, August 24th. Game one. Bretman out. Now the hype around the program is for real. Even HBO is out here doing a real sports piece on Manny Diaz taking over the Hurricanes football program. And Coral Gables, Mike Cunha, CBS4 Sports.